So I'm being invaded by weird little ghost worms. And as long as I take life way too seriously and click them to death, well, I get me some more skills, like more finger click damage. That's a crazy name for it. On to round two. What am I doing at 25 per click? Luckily, my archers also just sit there and mow things down for me. And now I even have talents I can spend my stuff on, like 3% more finger damage. Gimme. Let's also get myself an extra little archer. That got expensive real quick. 2k? Really? Well, here, have more arrow damage. Now my castle's shaping up. You can see I have two archers on it, and now there's flying ghosts. All right. How much damage do we do to these guys? At least enough. Oh, hello, big worm boss. Look at how cute this guy is, but how much damage is he doing? Like eight per hairball on my base? Stupid idiot. I clicked so well. You never stood a chance. He dropped me this nice little wooden ring, though. More arrow damage. Put that on. And let's upgrade my castle health twice. I started to use stones instead of wood. And then more arrow damage. Let's see. If I just don't partake in the fight, how do I do? It seems like my archers are able to hang in there. I do start getting drained of my HP really quick. Good thing I bought the upgrades, but we managed to hang on. Maybe I should upgrade the fire rate. Okay, well, that's 4,800 now. Back to just upgrading finger click damage. Round five, I'm able to take out a few of them. I managed to level up. Is that from just how many I've killed? I mean, I've killed a lot, so I guess that makes sense. It's only natural I get stronger. More finger clicking damage, and I got an extra little talent. I mean, if it's only going to cost me one mushroom to upgrade it again, might as well. And it's... Oh, I'm fighting crabs now. No. Get out of here, you gross little crustaceans. Delicious with butter. Annoying to have to fight. And how much do I get per click? I've upgraded it twice. 58. But these things have like 400 HP, so what's the point? I am being absolutely overwhelmed by crab ghost worms alike. Just keep clicking, even if it costs me my wrist. Who doesn't want to develop carpal tunnel at a young age? Finishing up round nine. Oh, I got a new item. Gold ring. This is big. Put you on. That gives me plus 10 gold. Sweet. Another talent point. Going into more finger damage. Damage. And I've got 5,000 gold now. I think I'm going to add on an extra archer. Increase my arrow damage up a bunch because now I can get lasers for 7,500. Wow. All right. And then just more normal finger damage. Round 10's here. Is there going to be anything big and scary? So far, it's a lot of just everything. Protect our castle at all costs, men. Okay, yeah, should have known. Big scary boss. It's a giant crab. <laughs> oh, gross. It's fine. He's starting to get melted. He's just a big old bullet sponge. He actually doesn't even do that much damage. Work on your pincers, buddy. Huh? Maybe go get them sharpened. Is that, did it just drop me Bitcoin? Oh no, an iron ring. That gives me a 5% crit chance. I don't really want that though. I like my arrow damage. For instance, extra yeah. archer. Farm the current round, non-boss. Okay. I mean, oh, I have to kill cats now. That's grim. Okay, there's a lot of them and I'm, I'm taking pretty heavy damage. Do I even make it through this round? Bruh. My health is dwindling real, real fast. Survey says, no, I'm dead. Well, fine. More castle HP then. I can put the farm on and I guess if I help out this time, We'll probably actually be able to win. Just need to keep my clicking going. And oh, I leveled up 100 more HP. And of course, another perk point for me to spend. I guess it wouldn't hurt to upgrade the arrow damage. And what is this? Power gem unlocks at round 25? Interesting. How many normal gems do I have now? Six? Well, a few more and I can buy a crap ton of gold. For right now, though, I just have to rely on all my intense clicking. So now let's add on even more arrow damage. Some more finger shooting damage. There's a floating chest here. Uh, pick this one. What's that give me? Then felt pretty good. 3,000 more gold. Time for more finger damage. Doing 78, so it's five clicks to kill uh, most things. My archers are doing 103, though. I mean, I really don't feel like I have to do much. They've just gotten juiced pretty heavily. Yeah, look, dead. I'm also realizing that if I just click right here on the bridge, I hit a ton of stuff. I just got to keep my mouse right here, and we just pretty much win. And I'm almost level six now, too. I've advanced on the map. Oh, I've moved up slightly. I need to kill the round boss to unlock to the next zone, all the way in that boss cave. Okay. Well, I think right now, what I need to do is get this laser upgrade. It gave me a bunch of gems, but also this what really weird that? looking tower thing. Is that just going to be another thing that shoots stuff? Go ahead. Oh, it's just a constant damage laser. That's, that's handy. Yeah, just go ahead. Keep letting them have it. And there's our next level up to, I think it's all coming together quite nicely. I wish I could get myself another archer though. Well, it does only cost 10,000. I could save up for it, or I could buy this increasing laser damage. Oh, and this one increases the laser range. Why not? Dual laser for 50. I do like the sound of that. And I, whoa, what is this item that just dropped? Gold banner? Put that on. Even more gold now. And I got another talent point. More arrow damage. Platinum ring just dropped. All damage plus five. All right, well, yeah, put that on. And on accident, I was farming round 14. Now we're on to round 15, where I am being absolutely rushed down by, oh my gosh, there are so many things. Okay, hello, everybody.
everybody. Appreciate you all. Well, that death hurt. Don't nope. worry. As long as I just hang in there, I can spend my gems for 30,000 gold twice. Bruh. So now I'm at 70,000. Go ahead and upgrade my archers. A $10,000 upgrade gives me more archer purchase. $5,000 and then 12,000 lets archers get more range. And then I can go ahead and get myself some more castle HP twice. Increase the arrow fire rate. Increase arrow damage twice. Now let's try to battle. I was saving up those gems for a special occasion. That occasion was whenever I couldn't win anymore. And it's, oh, I did round 14 again. Whoops. Bruh. All right, this time, but with feeling, I feel like we're hanging in there a bit more. We almost cleared out all of the mobs. There's just one big boss standing in our way. Maybe we just need some more laser damage and more normal finger damage. Trust me when I say I'm clicking as fast as I can, game. Just, no, oh, still not quite. All right, one more in round 14. Wait, I had mob speed at like max. No wonder I was being absolutely swarmed by everything. Yeah, yeah, complete this round. I've got 13,000, increase arrow damage, and then increase laser damage twice, up to 26. Now that mobs are gonna move at the normal rate, let's try battling where I can actually click and kill them. <laughs> Dude, this is so much more manageable. Who activated my double speed mob thing, huh? Whoever it is, they're fired and I hate them. Yeah, now it's just literally the solo boss who's getting lasered and eating all my arrows. So what if you're puking rainbows on me? They do 40 damage. You've stood no chance and now you're dead. This is this new enemy? Oh, they have shields. Scary. Whatever, just keep advancing in the rounds list. Look at that sweet, sweet gold piling up. And now I have a power gem slot that unlocks at round 25, which I'm really curious about, but there's two more locked ones right here that are not telling me what they are. I just need to keep mad dashing through the rounds until I'm strong enough to blow up anything that stands in my way. So far, it's been going great. Let's unlock another archer perch. That gave me more HP, but more importantly, I can hold more archers whenever I just eventually save up enough money. And I think I've realized that if I wanted to, I can just auto-click on this bridge uh and it murders things real real fast oh and what do you know another talent here have more arrow damage and let's increase my finger damage up more i still want to know what this mystery one is and wow this auto clicker definitely makes the difference all right yep just auto click into the afterlife thank you for trying oh uh, hello giant night boss do you know i have an auto clicker arrows and lasers yep that's okay please just murder well, it's not. I'm cheating. Brown. I think if I drop these rings on each other, my gold ring's level four now. Oh, I'm at 25,000 gold. I might as well just unlock Archer Purchase 3 because now I can unlock Explosive Weapon Upgrade Tower. I do like the sound of that. I think I also just got a power gem that I can't even use. So now I wonder, at round 22, if I stop crutching my auto clicker, can I survive? It started throwing a lot more things at me, but so far it seems like, yeah, I mean, I'm hanging in there. My castle also has 1,800 HP now, which could be a difference. And I am getting plenty of gold from these stupid little dummies. So much so, I think I just went up like 9,000. No way, I just got another banner. And I put that up there by chance. Dang it. All right, level up my gold banner. Even more gold for me now. And now I'm on to round 23. Let's just speed everybody up and then auto-click their life away as I'm ready for round 25. I want to see what my new unlock has in store. Get erased and murdered. Thank you. Also, yeah, one more thing and a nice little arrow damage. Round 24, also a bit of a cakewalk. I mean, again, cheating, but still. It's having fun that's important. Oh, I got a green banner this time. Gives me more experience gain. That's going to be real, real helpful. Now, if I can just beat round 25, actually turn the mob speed down. I'll just clear the first little segment. I want to know if I'm strong enough to beat the fourth way mark in my own power. Laser zapping, arrows flinging, crabs walking weird. I'm inclined to say this is coming along great. And the boss is a big old Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. What is this guy? Is that a shield of 17 damage? It's not really helping, is it, buddy? Archers hurt, huh? Yeah, get out of my face, freak. Ooh, an extra gold ring, combine that. And now I have power gems. Is it like a permanent perk point? Oh, they last through rebirth, but I can increase the damage per arrow with that. I mean, now I'm even stronger. How much are they doing now? 165 per arrow. I'm seeing 167 sometimes also. I can't lie to you, that feels pretty dang effective. Also, uh, I'm not able to beat any more waves without using my cheaty cheaty auto clicker. But what do you know? I have two lasers now. So now at round 26, is that, yep, just twice is effective. I thought it was going to be two lasers on the same thing. No, I just hit two things at once, like a fun magic eraser. Now, I think if I'm going to actually go and beat round 100, I'm just unlimiting the use of my auto clicker. It's fair game at this point. It's on my keyboard. These guys do eviscerate my health, though, and I still somehow almost didn't even win that round. This goes to show you how much extra little help I need now, huh? Just keep clearing them out. We got it. I saved up 50,000 gold. I also have a bunch of gems now. Can I just spend 10 of them? Yeah, sure enough. There we go. 164,000. Wow.
In that case, I might as well add on an archer and then unlock this weapon upgrade tower thing, which takes, holy crap, a lot of money. Oh, but only 50,000 to unlock research. Well, that's pretty much coming today. Round 29, get him out of here. I mean, my tower is looking pretty efficient now. There's still uh, so many enemies that rush at me. I actually can't believe I managed to survive. I think I really need to start upgrading my finger damage. Because now that I think about it, that should help me kill all these guys a little bit quicker. Doing 174 per click definitely is a lot better than like 110. They can still kind of pile up, which is scary, but I'm not super worried. Get sh shredded. Ooh, another gold banner. Level up. More finger damage with my perk point. Keep her going. What does autoplay do? Does it just automatically start the next round? What does AFK do? What, what is this? I've got like a little room. Can I take a bed there? Oh yeah, now my autoplay actually does just start the round without even upgrading me. If I just set my auto clicker down right here, does it manage to work? It seems like it did an efficient job at killing things. Most stuff at least ends up parked like right here. The only issue is things that are like flying, but it, it still works. Let the auto clicking game commence because wow. Okay, yep, just keep erasing them. All right. No. Nope. I... Oh, still didn't manage to survive. Okay. Well, here, I think it's pretty apparent. Need some more finger clicking damage. And then I can upgrade my arrow damage three times. Should hopefully help mitigate some. Upgrade my laser damage once. How are we doing now? I think it's going to be extremely close. But hey, look at that. I managed to survive. Well, more arrow range then. And now I think what I'll do is turn on autoplay. Set my auto clicker right here in front of my castle. And then I started at 17,000 gold for this wave if i just kind of let this go its course and i how did i die this time well here this time i had twenty-eight thousand gold at the start set my auto clicker up and let this run its course and survey says forty-three thousand gold at the end of it in that case i think just by upgrading my arrow range once and upgrading my tower health twice i can just kind of let this run and it should just kill everything and start farming me money so i'll just let this sit and then go fold my laundry two birds one stone a few minutes later well many a murder later i've got another ten talent point I can dump, but most importantly, I have 500,000 gold. And of course, I'm going to spend it by upgrading the range of my items, adding an extra archer for 250,000, getting my research, which does it cost $25,000 to do this? Okay, well, that's going to increase my experience more. But most importantly, missile launcher. How are we doing with this? There's my missile go, just 520 damage on one creature. Also, the extra archer on this, I mean, I'd, they're just getting decimated now. Just keep on tapping their lives away please round over i can move on into round 35 i assume there's gonna be a boss i mean it is a five wave and sure enough i'd be right all right no auto clicker how's it going laser's good all the arrows i mean he just doesn't stand a chance it's just it's pathetic die giant crab oh hey my experience research done give me that now i've got 40 blue gems i can spend let's just buy mm, i don't know half a million in gold again i can max out my arrow range max out my laser range spend the hundred thousand on focus my arrows and 150 on arrows that are going to continuously home to targets and then let's just upgrade my arrow damage on top of all of that and so now if i really get it going the auto plays on the auto clickers on i think it's time for us just to be able to mass spam our way through some waves i decided to upgrade my finger ability and i just got an automatic one but i'm using an auto clicker so that's just a waste instead i think it'd be better to upgrade my laser damage a whole bunch because that's erasing things a lot faster now and oh i got 10 more blue gems 188k thank you let's go ahead and upgrade more castle hp and then we'll just leave this auto fighting i don't know i'll just come back in like 30 more rounds or something well after letting it run for a while i can beat this boss but what i'm looking at is the ability to install this cannon on top of my tower now it seems like it's gonna do a lot of damage also these mobs are just faster by default now is the cannon gonna explode or anything i'm not seeing it do anything oh it does like 2,000 damage through every mob it goes through that's crazy strong between that my missile and my laser tower i'm not not sure which one I like best. Actually, yeah, I am. It's my auto clicker. That's the real killer.